Welcome back everyone, Drake Hawkins with you again, and today we're going to be looking at a new showcase called Moon Base. It's a fantastic space survival simmy thing, base building thing. It's, it's amazing, and you get to play as a cat. So that's pretty much all that we need to know about it. Uh, we got the closest thing to a blue, or blue right there, and uh, let's go with that little guy. Uh, my son suggested a great name for him. He is a space cat named... Astrophy, if I got that right. Yes, Astrophy. Excellent. And we're going to be going with normal mode. Mission to land on planet T0F860 and survive for 34 days. Hmm. Strange. The, na the code for the planet is different. Oh, hello. This is us. WASD to move around. We can uh, punch various different things. I mean, paw them. Uh, not trees, apparently. Nope, not rocks. Nope, not those. We got a, a chest full of uh, supplies here. We basically get our starter equipment. Yes, there we go. We got the air cleaner and the uh, biofuel processor. Uh, top right of the screen, you'll see our health and our food. Kitty needs to eat. Kitty, does. I don't think Kitty's got nine lives. Maybe he does. Maybe we respawn and we get multiple lives if we die. Um, it'd be cool if it was nine of them. We got uh, some scraps there. There's the rest of our gear, I think. Yes, the airlock and the workbench. All right. Apparently, we can have, like, a ton of workbenches just by hitting this button, I've heard. We'll see. Uh, lots of goodies around. we got to make sure our O2 doesn't run down before we... Uh, oh, look at all the scraps over there. Uh, before we get all that we need from to get ourselves started. Uh, workbench will allow us to, like, build a tool that would probably be faster. In fact, I could throw down a workbench right up here and then uh, well I gather this stuff and then make us a shovel right we can make one excellent it's ready and if I was it hold right click nope hold right click yes to remove it get my workbench back excellent now I got me a shovel it's not any faster but I can get rocks and stuff now uh, we're at about half o2 so we should probably do something about that oh I ran out of space as well Okay, well, let's head back over by our, uh, our thing. If I hit M, it brings up a map. The yellow dot there is our base. All right, let's go. Uh, let's let's build on here, on this fancy stuff here. This fine regolith, as it may be known. Um, I think we'll, like I guess we can make the base kind of right up in here. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Uh, and now I want the airlock. Can I rotate there? Oh, I can do. Uh, I guess I want the airlock rotated that way, right? I think. Let's throw a workbench down beside the airlock and our fuel generator mm, the other side. Lovely. Okay, so there's no fuel in there right now. If I, I think wood and plants, if I click on it, oh, I guess it was wood. Uh, if I click on it with something else, there we go. Wood, plants, roots, and juice the orange looking thing let's uh eat one of those tasty things and that brings our hunger up a bit uh can i gather this guy no nope. can i gather it with no nope. apparently not i can gather ore though there we go uh oh getting low on the o2 our uh, our tank our machine rather our base is making us some o2 at the moment i'm gonna clear out this stuff nearby well it continues to crank along it has a limited there's the warning your air is getting low uh oh it worked, right? There we go. Now we're in... No. Uh... Uh-oh. I think I put the airlock in backwards. <laughs> Let's do that again, shall we? Is that better? Don't die. Wait, good way to start it out. Just dying right off the top. There we go. Now it's good. And click and we're in. Yay! Okay, we absorbed the base's O2 into our tank. And we really need a lot more. We'll let it, it'll keep filling up as long as this thing is running. There's a green bar for our, um, the uh, energy level in that thing. That's pretty good. Get some stone. I know we need some of those to get going. I don't think we can harvest those until we get something super epic. There we go. Uh, what else do we need now? Now there's science-y stuff we can do. Uh, we need a smelter to make... There we go, that's what we needed those stone for. We need a smelter to make some uh, metal plates, and we need metal plates to make a research lab. Uh, smelter's going to need base connection as well. 
So I guess we put him. We can put him right there. That's fine. That's a little awkward. Uh oh. Oh no! I'm out of O2. Look at my health go down. <sighs> Better. Better, little base. Uh, so from let's click on the crafts. It's getting pretty dark. We could turn on our turn on our light, but that would use up power. We can make meals with the uh, plant slop. Fantastic tasting stuff, I'm sure. Uh, with the greenery that we got, and then if I right click on that, it gives me it says it gives me 80 hunger. That was a good chunk. Health's going back up slowly. Uh, let's grab the wood and toss it in there. It seems to be a pretty good source of of uh, um, heat for us. Now this, I wonder. I haven't used a torch before. I wonder if that just hold that and it lights the place up, or do I? Oh, I place it. Mm hmm. Ah, I see. Well, that's pretty lame lighting. I must say. Oh, there we go. I don't know how long it lasts for, but it's, we're just gonna have to go with the dark for a while. Uh, this. Oh, the, it's raining outside. Well, look at that. Certainly not our moon. Uh, let's go and make up a bunch of these. There we go. Four metal plates. I think that's what we needed for a lab, right? Yeah. No, five we need. Electronics and scrap metal we have. We need one more metal plate after that. Do I have the metal? I don't seem to. I can use my flashy light to look around for some more metal. Ooh, hello, blue mushroom thingy. Uh, I think they're used for products later. Oh, that was pretty good. Oh, oh, oh nice. Look at that. Oh, daylight has come. We got some logs, we got some tasty, juicy fruits. They're like fruit roll-ups, but they're in a ball form. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. And this green stuff, I'm fairly sure is catnip. Could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure it's catnip. Scraps. Ice is used to make, uh, clearly, water, but um, we seem to have enough of that. There's some metal sitting around. Oh, some more over there. Oh, more. Good. We shall get lots of... Oh, man. Huge supply. Uh-oh. We're running low on power. Running really low on power. Gotta get a bunch of metal. Base is up to the north. Northeast. Uh-oh. Suit power offline. It won't tell us when we're hungry. I think I left my flashlight on, didn't I? Probably. That'd be why I killed the battery. So I don't know if we're gonna, like, run out of... Run low on O2 at this point. Ah! An artifact! Uh, excellent. We'll come back for that, though. We know he's there. Can I, like, harvest all this stuff before I die? Probably. You know, probably. I'd like to make it through without dying. That would be great. That would be super, super stellar. I, I think you respawn, but I think there's, like, save points or something. Like, you gotta make it to a certain point before you will respawn. Don't quote me on this. Pretty new at this. Uh, it is available on Steam Early Access point, version 0.48 or something like that. So it's it's well into production, so you're not tech, talking completely untouched. Oh, that was our... Uh, I think that was our oxygen warning. We should probably uh, tend to getting or make ourselves get back home. Um, it's not a brand new game. It's been out for a little while, but it's, not, it's also not like hyper-developed and finished and all that jazz. Oh, you won't pick up because... Space. There we go. We got power back from the generator let's throw another log on the fire there our o2 is very low so we probably need to expand our base quite substantially and aggressively uh, inventory is full can't get any more okay um can i oh i can't even interact with it the inventory is low um uh, okay make me some more of those yes that worked uh what else can we craft well we could craft some workbenches but we don't need to um we could get another fuel generator, and I think that's probably a good idea. You know, I can just take some stuff and throw it on the ground. Let's just throw a shovel here with Q on the ground, and then I can gather the uh, metals, and then I can probably smelt up some more. Excellent. I think another smelter wouldn't be a bad idea, but uh, I don't want to make gears at this point. I want to make a lab thing, which is five of those. We got five now. Excellent. Close that baby up. Give me some more oxygen while I'm standing around here. Crafts a research lab. So those artifacts that we saw down there, that's going to give us uh, fancy research. The artifacts are hilarious. You'll want to see them. Um, out of power, huh? Oh, I see. 
Hmm. Oh, when that's running, we don't have enough power to run the base. So we definitely need a second one of these babies. Uh, you can go... Um, you know what? I'm going to remove... Uh, no, I don't want to. I'm going to put it there. For now, we can expand the base out. I can walk on this. It looks like it's solid, but I can walk on it. Uh, we don't have any research tokens for you, but that emptied out some space. If I get another generator, that would be good. And then I think we will... Um, you know what? I'm going to actually put a generator up here. Uh, right there seems like a good idea and if we grab our fuel we can toss it on there and he can get going we could also use uh, oranges fruit 15 hunger but it also gives a tiny bit of fuel not great uh, we could do this which gives us a, a little bit more than the orange I think but not a lot uh, okay what else keep smelting that's what we need to do smelty smelt smelt we got a lot of uh, stone or we had a lot of iron not stone, iron. Mm, we did research. We gotta go get some research to unlock some basic stuff right away. So let's do that next. Uh, oh my goodness, it's dark. We where was our where was our research thing? Was it to the south? I feel like it might have been. Let's suck up the oxygen into the suit. There we go. We're at a solid uh, solid suit count. I'm gonna drop like that there, and maybe the mushrooms here. Uh, plates. Okay, cool. Can we smelt a couple more? Lovely. Oh, we're in short on hunger, huh? We can do that on the way. Om nom nom. Have dinner as we go. Throw on me flashlight. Me flashlight is awesome. I thought we had an artifact around here somewhere. Uh-oh. I tossed my shovel. Oh, I need to go back to my shovel. That's unfortunate. I left my... Oh, lightning storm. Ah! Don't get electrocuted. That'd be bad. Give me shovel. Yikes! That's scary. I don't want to be electrocuted. Uh, I wonder if I could... Oh, wow. <laughs> That's intense. Alright. Let's harness the power. Uh, there we go. Oh! I think that's like a pre-warning. Like, you might get electrocuted if you stand here. We'll see. By not standing there, I mean, That's what we'll see. Shovel, 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 shovel. Oh, there's some... Oh! Whoa! Ho, ho. Nice! There we go, we got some more metal. That's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a uh, artifact, that square block thing that gives us research. I already forgot where I found one. There it is! Oh! Get out! Dodge them bullets! I think that's how that works. Like, it could be totally wrong. It could be just light electrocuted anyway. So. Day three! 31 days left in our mighty mission to survive. Look at the little paw prints. <laughs> I love it. Okay. We have to go research and find out what that artifact does. We're about to run out of power, and I just broke my shovel. So I guess we're headed home. Uh, power's going to run out because I left my darn flashlight on again. Good job, Drake. Good job. Uh, map is always nice. I like that we can use the map in spite of the fact that we're out of power. That is encouraging. Uh, you need a bit of fuel, and you will need a bit of fuel. I don't think I can fuel you from here. There you go. Fill everything up. Get that research going. That is the artifact. Takes two minutes. Let it process, and we'll uh, do some more stuff. Now, um, let's see. We have some ore. We can smelt some more ore. Uh, smelt four more of those. I wouldn't mind a new shovel. I think we broke ours good and I think we've got enough power running to keep things rolling for a while and there and craft a couple more lovely let's go off to the west if that's how the uh, cardinal directions work on the strange moon like planet our planets moons and moons planets I guess it depends on their uh, orientation to one another doesn't it ice ice baby give me my own J OJ Mm -mm. Harvesting some lovely resources. So we're doing good on the gathering of the resources. We got to tech up though. So I'm gonna need, kind of want to make sure that I find an artifact as often as I can. Because if I remember correctly, they give you f like five or something like that samples, and we'll look in the tech tree right away what that does. Uh, I could use another bite of dinner. Some tasty plant slop. Because everybody likes plant slop. 
well, these moon kitties do. Would you like to be a moon kitty? Look at all the resources. Everywhere. Everything good. Oh man, we had to play Machiavellian again. That was a fun game. <laughs> it's a goofy game. Ah, there we go. Artifacts. Uh, oh, we can't even get plant supplies. Let's uh, let's head back to base. We know that there's one up here. And I believe that means we are... Oh, no, we're northeast of the base. We'll head directly... Uh, northwest, rather. We'll head directly northwest after we get back to base here. Um, I'm going to drop the roots because we'll need them later, but not quite yet. Is our research done? Oh, there it is. Look at that. We've discovered a can of tuna fish. Oh, that's a sweet artifact. Uh, the research is available. There's a research log here. We can look at the artifacts. Apparently, we have to gather them all. That looks like a wind-up mouse, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> a fish on a stick, or a toy on a stick. Is that a laser pointer? Oh my goodness, we need it. <laughs> That's fantastic. Uh, this allows us to get uh, garden patches, water, root stew, and hearty meals. Hmm. And this one will in allow us to do construction, which is a construction yard allowing us to make more habitats and airlocks and all that jazz. Uh, I think we go with the construction first. Unlocked. Okay. Now we can research, research, not use, but research new uh, power and uh, looks like tools. Storage would be nice. And, uh, oh, that takes 10 samples. Five, five, five. Okay, so we need to get another artifact going right away. Uh, I'm standing in the airlock, but I'm not standing inside with the airlock closed, so that was sad. Let him do something a little bit. It'll keep charging as long as it's got supply, so... Let's fuel that baby up. And this one up here. We're getting a little low on the lumber. I like having the fruit tree right now, right nearby. So it's, you know, a couple of those and we can at least... Uh, we can at least supply basic fuel if we're in an emergency situation. There you go. A little bit of crafting there. You toss up a bit more oxygen. And then we'll run up and grab that artifact. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 50. We need more habitat stuff, so the construction yard is definitely going to be a must have real soon. Craft some more of those. Let one finish so I can get the tile emptied in my inventory. There we go. Now, oops, I ran into something. Flashlight, please. I'm running into a tree. That's a dog thing to do, not a cat thing to do. Come on, Drake. Uh, let's see. Over here somewhere? A little harder to find in the dark. There he is. Artifact. I think we'll just grab it and go straight back. Because it is dark. Just uh, pan our way over this way. I love how the, sh the things cast shadows and everything. It's so good. So well done. Can I walk between these? No. I think I can walk between these. Yes. There we go. Alright. We can, oh, we can craft uh, stone walkways now. And pavement if we had water. Love it. Okay, let's uh, juice up the O2s and get the science researching again. Fantastic. Uh, well, we won't watch that for two minutes. That would be a very boring episode. Uh, construction yard is what we need. Ooh, stone walls. Hmm, why would we need simple, effective stone walls? Just for decoration, I would hope. Hope there's nothing that's going to come eat us at night. Oh, we're at day three, so maybe there isn't. Uh, we need, for the construction yard, three gears, two beams, and electronics. Hmm. Um, we'll let those run down a little more. O2 is pretty full. Beams require two ore. Okay. And the gears use up some of our plates. There's three gears. Do we have an electronic? We have some. Okay, we just need some plates. So let's... Uh, how's our food situation? A little on the low side. Uh, we could actually go ahead and have a nice tasty bowl of slop or two. And that should get us going. Now, I remember there was some stuff up by the artifact, but I don't remember what it was. Because I have uh, a memory like a vice. It holds on to information, doesn't let me have it. Ice. There we go. We need uh, we need ore, because we're going to need to make a lot. Oh, there's another electronics. I like when we get the bonus items from those. That's nice. Um, like the gears when you get them out of a scrap spot. Oh, nice. Look at all that fruit. Tasty OJ. It looks like orange. Ah! Artifact! Yes! Lovely. Need to keep those rolling in. I think we'll go left here and then we'll swing up to the right. 
plus one artifact. Oh, we got some logs over there. We'll have to go that way because that's our primary energy source right now. I'd like to get the uh, battery or the not batteries, the solar panels unlocked. That'll help us during the day to reduce the fuel use at least. I think. Oh man, I got to go back up. Uh oh, I did it again, guys. Left my darn flashlight on all the time, all the time. All right, scraps. Please don't make me come back for stuff. There we go. I have no idea how much supply we've got, but, uh, like, O2 and stuff, but we should be okay for at least enough time. And I can pick that up, or that. Oh, no, I got the stone. I can get that. I only have this for my inventory. There's no other, like, inventory sheet or anything, or supplies or anything. So, what you got is in the bottom there. What you see is what you get. That's it. No idea how... Oh, I keep moving and interrupting. No idea how much resources I'm going to be able to, or how much longer I'm going to be able to go off of the resources I've got in my suit. It's going to probably beep at me real soon. And scream and say, you're running out of air. I should probably, I've kind of got the feel that I'm running to the right. I think, yeah. Oh, I'm quite a ways away, actually. Harvest fast, Drake. Harvest fast. So we got a lot to, a lot of running to do after this. Oh, yeah. Is good. There it is. There's the warning. There's the get back fast or you're going to die warning. So let's get back fast. Any chance of seeing an artifact on the way? that we? Because we haven't walked through this space before, I don't think. Got that rocky road thing along the way here. That's all right. Where's my base? Where's my base? Where's my base? A little further. Onto the desert lands. Oh, we're running pretty short on... Oh, nice root fat. Uh-oh. Ah, it's just south. Quick, run, man, run. You're going to run out of O2. You're turning blue in the face. Hawkins blue is one thing, but that's ridiculous. <sighs> Uh-oh. Uh, no power in the suit. There we go. Juice up my suit. Research finished. We got the wind-up mouse. Artifact number 11. Yeah. Uh, let's research another one. That's awesome. Uh, very, very overly excited about that, you know. Uh, we need metal beams. It gave us a little bit of oxygen. I'd really like some more of that. Let's make uh, two of those metal beams. Let's see what the construction yard needs. It's just the two beams, okay? Once we're done that... Uh, there you go. There's one. I'd love to have this, this up here. That would probably be better, right? And we can do everything from inside the base. and we can, If we knock that out later, we can like expand the base up here and have the structures along the side. I like that idea. I think that would be smarter. We don't have to keep going in and out. Let's do this. Uh, there we go. Pick it up. Oh, wait. I'm, out of, I'm out, of, out of room. Go here. Make me a construction yard. Awesome. And then uh, pick that up. And place it down. Not another lightning storm. Stay away, lightning storms. Uh, there. There. We have uh, roots. We do. No, no, no. In here. There's our construction yard. Excellent. Let's drop him down there. And I want to probably make another O2 generator, I'm thinking. Okay, so I need to have a habitat module. That's there. Using a bunch of metal plates. And then when it's finished, we can use the component, two components and an electronic to make an air cleaner. Love it. Uh, and then we'll place that down here because that's something we can walk straight through. That's part of the base. How long is it? Oh, it's not bad. So that's pretty quick pr production of all these things. Right there. Excellent. Now, we still have to power these things with uh, logs here, so... 12 seconds left on the research. Look at that. Now we're generating some power. That's awesome. Uh, or some O2. See, now we can hold 75. That's based on how many habitat modules are there. Uh, each one of them holds 25, it seems. Research finished. We got a brush! Oh, kitty needs a good brush in it. All right, now we are going to hit the research tab and check out the new options. Uh, do we do solar panel first or uh, some storage? Probably be really nice. Uh, I think maybe tools and storage. Then we'll come back for the food. We'll do a little bit of a scout and then come back for the food. Let's do. Let's unlock tools. We can now get an axe, an improved shovel, a sturdier shovel, chop down tree-ish things, and then the jackhammer. Powerful tool that breaks up large rocks. Oh, excellent. Uh, keep away, uh, keep your junk safely stored away for later in the cargo container. And the indoor storage sounds like a better idea. Holds even more items. 
Um, I like this idea because that would it's a habitat space, so it probably gives us O2 storage as well. Alright, uh, and we might want it actually there. That would probably be a smart call. Can I make a jackhammer, please? You know what? I should actually make an axe. That would be better. We're almost out of our shovel, so we'll craft that as well. What's the jackhammer take? Ah, gear, or electronics. No, what are they? Wires. Uh, inventory is full. Well, um, that's not great. Fuel is out up there, so let's uh, fuel him. Uh, we can make another habitat, but our inventory is full. Let's see. Oh, what? What? Oh, I'm hungry. I'm like, what's going on? What's this? What's the strangeness? Make me. Uh oh. Mm, okay. That's sad. I don't have uh, food for that. Uh, cute. And eat some fruits. Eat lots of fruits. Don't get sick to your tummy, little kitty. There you go. Uh, if I go in here, and then I can make a habitat module. Excellent. And the storage is going to be just a cargo storage with a habitat module. Cargo storage must be made here. Yes? Yes, it is. Lovely. Doing okay with the uh, supplies here. Uh, we're just about out of fuel. Just about out. Uh, inventory's full. Okay. Um. 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 Let me out. Let's toss that there. Get the storage. I'll toss it there for the moment. And then if I can maybe... Man, we need it. We definitely need these uh, these things built because we don't have the space to use them. But if I can take this away, please. Uh, my O2 is going to disappear from it. That's unfortunate. That's okay. I want you to be... Craft me that, pick up that guy. We can put the O2 thing up here afterwards, but we're gonna need a uh, we're gonna need the jackhammer before we can get that done. Okay, so let's see. Storage. Lovely. Okay, let's put uh stuff. What do we need? Oh I could make some sloppy soup stuff, couldn't I? There we go. Nice food supplies. Uh, running low on food, on power though. Jeepers. It's very unfortunate. Two slops. Excellent. Give me some food. I want to be full to my tummy. Um, I'm going to put the air cleaner in there and uh, our shovel for the moment. Uh, we'll probably only make metals and components when, or electronics when we're here. Um, we pick up scraps and all this stuff a lot. That's so probably okay. Give me my tool. Let's pick up as much of this stuff as I can. I can I can access this from the outside, but this should be okay here. Mm, yeah, that's good. The rest we need. Uh, there we go. And if I have, if I'm not mistaken, that is a regular tree. That's just a tree-ish thing. There's another tree-ish thing. The berry ones look different, right? There's a berry one up here? Yeah. The berry ones look vibrant and, and orange. I'm not sure why the trees look vibrant when they're orange, but that's how it feels like to me. Alright, so we've got ourselves a basic base. We've got, uh, we've got storage. We've got some uh, supplies. We've got some new tools. Pretty epic. We can uh, make ourselves a, uh, a few new components to our base. We still have more research to go for sure. We've unlocked... Uh, the, build, the construction and the tools. We need to make a jackhammer. We've got storage. I'd like to unlock the cooking so we get better food real soon. Uh, we are running a little low on the fuel here, so we'll have to make sure that keeps going. Let's craft some metals. And uh, I think next thing we need to do is go hunting for some more research labs, but that will have to be in next episode. Thank you, everybody, for joining me. Hope you're enjoying this little look. It's a seven-day showcase on Moon Base, and we are going to be uh, be back tomorrow for some more. So if you like it, hit the like button. It uh, helps out me to know the series is uh, getting your attention and you're enjoying it. Uh, the game is available on Steam. Link will be in the description below, so check it out there if you... Uh, if you want, let me know. If you played the game, comments are much appreciated. If you have questions about it, I always do answer all the questions in the comment section that are reasonable and relevant. So thank you so much, and we'll see you in game.